i danas smo u Lučkom kod Circuit Mesta. Dođe! Albert Gajšek kao poduzetnik. Albert kao inovator i Albert kao uzor, kao inspiracija za mladih u Hrvatskoj, u tehnologiji i tako dalje. Kako je za vas? A dosta interesantno pitanje ovo je. Pa gledaj, kao prvo, ono, da Albert kao poduzetnik mora dosta ovako puno raditi oko svega toga, ali ne radi to zbog toga da bi sada bio inspiracija drugima, nego da se napravi ono biznis na koji će se stvarno biti ponosan, koji će biti dobar, koji će biti profitabilan, koji će u konačnici svaki mjesec moći splatiti plaće i u konačnici ovaj napraviti nekakav profit, da svi budu zadovoljni s time. A Albert sada kao nekakav ono inspiracija nešto, ono, ne bih rekao baš da je to nešto što sam htio da da se onako dogodi, ali se dogodilo s vremenom ovaj i drago mi je što mogu ono i drugima zapravo tu u Hrvatskoj koji tek su na početku tog poduzetničkog puta ili na početku tog svojeg nekog inovatorskog puta što im mogu onako pokazati i pomoći i nekako ih zapravo motivirati da naprave nešto svoje. So, how do, you, how do you manage that on a day-to-day -day basis of kind of making a product in, in a larger marketplace, but also doing this thing that's about teaching kids STEM and helping them be builders? My role is to generate revenue for the company, to, you know, manage all the finances and to, at the end, you know, pay everyone and generate some profit. But I also think that we have a much greater role here, you know, a role where we educate other children, where we make our, their lives, you know, more and enjoyable and fun, you know, and as I said, you know, uh, the, the creation part before this, it's very important for me to to solve this issue because it was an issue that I had when I was a child, you know, I was so bored with textbooks and everything that I wanted to do something with my hands and that's why I'm sort of like solving this issue of, you know, young Albert with these devices. <laughs> I really, I really hope, you know, that everything that we're doing here is going to help someone get into technology and sort of like, you know, just think a, a bit more open. So can you tell us a little bit about your personal connection to the United yeah. States, your business's connection to the United States, and maybe the, the ideas and the spirit that, that are linked? So basically, at, at the beginning of this whole business, you know, we did this Kickstarter campaign, you know, and yeah. it, it, you know, it, I, was, I was so um, insecure that this whole idea could really happen. And the, the part where I said, okay, this makes sense, I'm going to focus on all of my time and energy on it, was when on Kickstarter, most of our customers, customers came outside of Croatia. So th it was mostly people from Europe. US, UK, Germany. So those markets that, you know, they, they weren't my friends that just supported me out right. of pity. There were, you know, some incognito customers. They, they, they saw value in that product, you know, and that was sort of like a proof that this makes sense. When you support something on a crowdfunding platform, you are following this journey of this entrepreneur who is trying to build a product, you know, and I was so, you know, I felt so connected with those creators from the US that are creating, you know, great products. And I always, wanted to create something myself, you know, that's why I actually created this Kickstarter campaign when I was 18 and this is the thing that actually, you know, made this business happen because without this, kick, this Kickstarter campaign we wouldn't have the money to kick all of this off. Croatia now is part of the visa waiver program. We're talking yeah. about travel and as much as what you do is is kind of um, online and virtual, you got to physically be places too. Yeah. You talked about going as a young a young man uh, yeah. to kind of big networking conferences in the US. The travel was very important, especially before COVID, you know. Yeah. I was traveling to conferences like every like every two months I would go somewhere, you know. Uh, I was at CES uh, in 2018, you know, it was an awesome experience, really a booster for my whole business and you know getting a visa was a huge pain I would say so this is going to help I, I suppose and I hope it's going to help quite a lot of you know entrepreneurs from Croatia here to you know visit those international fairs. And so Albert you've got a, a partnership uh, that's really exciting right now that has some really cool US ties. Uh, the Batmobile. Uh, tell yeah. us a little bit about that um, and how, how it's come together. Basically, you know, we were joking at the office, like, let's make a Batmobile, and it was a joke. But then, at one point, I started thinking about it seriously, you know, and I was, you know, reading how licensing works, you know, what yep. it is, because I had no idea about it. And then, at one point, we, you know, became brave enough to actually reach out to someone from that's working with Warner Bros. and to actually create something. And, you know, it was a very long 
and tedious process in my opinion you know because we had to reach so to, to overcome so many stages you know so many concepts and stuff you know and at the beginning i i was thinking like the dream was so big there was no way warner is going to you know work with us you know right. but i i wanted to send this pitch just so that i can say okay we have tried it and you know now we are giving up you know but it turns out they were really interested about the whole story they were really interested about the product and they uh, decided to work with us and now we have created the product you know which is basically a licensed product an official product in collaboration with them and we are the only company uh, in this whole region that has gotten a global licensing deal from Warren so it has been you know really amazing <laughs> Tell me about these photos that actually are kind of responses from people out in the world yeah, that you're is, connected to. Yeah, this was some kind of a joke, you know, that we actually did. We did, <laughs> we did not update this for a long time. I but see James Bond and Elon Musk. And yeah, like some of them are <laughs> Photoshop, but most of them are actually, you know, real photos that people have been sending us from all yeah. across the world. This like shows, you know, that 95% of our sales they go outside Croatia, you know, yeah. and we, we're very, very proud about this, you know, because we never wanted to be a local business, we wanted to be something that's going to touch people all across the world, you know, that was very, very important to, you know, to, to me personally and also like to serve as a company. Yeah, yeah I mean, it, uh, this is a nice closer, I mean, you're impacting people yeah. uh, and, and again, as the U.S. mission to have somebody who's collaborating with the United States in innovative ways, but also leading young people to kind of this future as builders and creators. Um, it's so exciting. So, hvala vam puno. Hvala tebi. I vidimo se uskoro, nadam se. Vidimo se. Thank you very much. Thank you.